there, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for being here today. My name is Joss, and if you love to talk about fragrance and perfume, you've come to the right place, and I hope you consider subscribing. If you're just joining me for the first time, welcome. I'm so glad you're here. And if you're returning, thank you so much for your support, and welcome back. Just an FYI, I always put my playlists down in my description boxes now, but you can always go to my playlist tab and check out my playlist. I have over 250 videos now, so they're organized by playlist. You can watch whatever playlist you want. You can binge watch on any particular topic that I have. And if you have suggestions, please let me know. I'm always interested in your suggestions and recommendations for new video topics. So today I'm really excited to bring you a new perfume. I don't think it's actually new, but this is new to me. And this is something I heard about from Sarah from Glam Finds. I'll link her channel below. She's got a really great channel. She finds some really interesting, her name is perfect. She finds some really interesting perfumes that I had never heard of. So this was one, actually this is from a line that she recommended. So this is from Jesus Del Pozo, who is a fashion designer. And he also has a fragrance line. And um, I think he's probably most well known for Halloween and the Halloween Flankers. That's a perfume line that he has. But then he has this special line that I believe is marketed to the Middle Eastern market. And these are available on fragranceby.ca. That's where I found this um, after watching Sarah's videos. So this one is called Cashmere Bouquet Nights. The ones that Sarah reviewed on her channel are Vanilla Musk Nights and saffron nights and then there's another one that is tobacco nights on fragrance by but i decided to get this one cashmere bouquet and it is so beautiful this is a 3.4 ounce tester um i don't know why i always do that i always <laughs> you've probably noticed um i've been noticing in my videos anyway um this is a 3.4 ounce tester and it was around $60. And um, all the, the four from this line are around $60 each, which is such a good deal because this is so, so amazing. I wore this today. I will say it does have a downside that I don't know if other people experience this or if it's just me. This seems to be an issue for me lately, but lately I have been having longevity issues <laughs> and that is true with this one too. So it's gorgeous. It um, only lasted about three hours on me, I think, and then it just becomes a very faint skin scent. So this particular fragrance, fragrance has bergamot, pink pepper, cardamom, vanilla blossom, neroli, white blossoms, musk, cashmere wood, oud, vetiver, and patchouli. And it is so, it doesn't smell like anything I've smelled before. Um, it's just amazing. And I'm just gonna spray it on again because it's worn off. It's, this is not maybe a safe blind buy, I don't think. If you don't like Oud, I would skip these. Um, but if you like Oud and you like that um, rich, deep, intense, I was so surprised that it didn't last because it smells like something that's really gonna last. Um, it's, I still love it and I'm still gonna wear it because um, it's gorgeous. It's. I can't even think of something to compare it to. So I'm really interested in the other two that Sarah talked about on her channel, the Vanilla Musk and the Dark Saffron one, because I love this one so much. And this is like a really heavy bottle and I think it's kind of cool looking. Um, but I just wanted to mention this because it's so gorgeous and I haven't seen these anywhere besides Fragrance by. They're really hard to find online. Um, it's even hard to find information about these at all. So I think they maybe came out in 2017. I'm not totally sure, but I'm so tempted to buy all of them. I'm gonna have to restrain myself, but I love this so much. It's like, it's it's so beautiful. And um, it's like, it smells a little bit vintage. It smells deep. It smells rich. It smells exotic. It's intense. It's, um, it's probably something, um, it's very gender neutral. So this to me, this just does not read particularly feminine or masculine to me. This is like right on the line um, for gender neutrality. Um, it's just stunning. This just arrived in a plain box. So sometimes when you get a tester, it doesn't have a cap. This obviously has a cap and um, it just arrived in a plain box. So it didn't come with its original box. I don't know how much these cost originally when they first came out. I'm guessing it was a lot more than $60. This does not smell like a $60 perfume. 
Um, it's just, it's just amazing. So um, this is something that I could see like decanting, putting into smaller little travel sprays that I could carry around with me so I could reapply it throughout the day. It's not particularly office friendly. It's, it's amazing. So I wanted to just thank Sarah and um, just share this little find because this is stunning and I can't really, I can't really think of anything to compare it to. It's like I said, it's got a slight vintage vibe. It's got a very dark, very wintry. This is very cold weather appropriate. If you don't like gender neutral fragrances, you might not like this. But so again, that is Isus Del Pozo Cashmere Bouquet Nights. And it's part of a series and there are three other ones that are currently on fragranceby.ca. I'm just pretty astounded and really um, want to, like I said, want to pick up the whole line. I have to restrain myself. I don't need more perfume. You can see it all there behind me. <laughs> but this was so beautiful. So again, thank you, Sarah from Glam Finds. It's it's amazing and I just wanted to share this with you. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and if you didn't, feel free to give it a thumbs down and I'll see you again very soon. Thank you.